Hey everybody, welcome to this week's fishing report. We fished Wapaka County this weekend. How do we do it? It was pretty hit and miss, to be honest. Um, one thing that we did that was a little bit different than normal is we actually hit the same body of water um, two different days. Um, and it was interesting because it fished different on both occasions. So Saturday, um, we definitely were noticing bigger um, groups of fish deeper. What else? Yeah, I guess we were noticing some groups of fish deeper. Um, we actually had a little bit more wind little bit more sun is warm and then we came in today um, and today you know was a lot harder to find groups of fish um, they just were not actually in the places that they were the day before um, so with that we noticed that the wind switched a little bit we did try a little bit shallower um, kind of some weedier spots uh, and we found that trolling kind of through these places had a little bit more success um, and actually today Josh had um, kind of a lot of luck with a little bit of spinner blade attached to his jig yeah, I had a beetle spin attached and it was okay. We caught some smaller crappies and, and a couple nice bluegills off the weed line. Um, bluegills were still a little bit out deep. The only thing we didn't check today is suspended schools out in the deep basin just because, I don't know, we were doing just fine with the other stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's really good. Overall colors this week, um, chartreuse, I guess, is seems to be what I would lean towards, but I got to admit, I changed my jig in color probably 300 times. Um, and the other thing is sometimes I was using like a 16th ounce jig and sometimes I was using one of the smallest tungstens that I could find in my box. So, um, you know, it's funny how that bite changed from that larger profile to that teeny tiny profile. Um, sometimes it was split by crappies and bluegills with the bluegills liking the smaller bait and the crappies the bigger, but that was not always the case. And especially towards the evening, the bluegills would get feisty and nip at those larger profiles as well. Yep. With that, um, you know, it is becoming fall, so start looking towards those deeper brush piles um, and watch those water temperatures because fish do like to, you know, follow into those warmer zones. So um, we'll be out here on the water and can't wait to see you here too. Yep. Have a good one.